Hi, my name is Alan and I'm a software engineering student at UWA. I applied for this opportunity since working with supercomputers was unique for me and sounded really interesting. I always thought neural networks or deep, le deep learning models were a very fascinating mathematical concept as complex functions that you can tune to solve many incredibly difficult problems. One such problem being the extraction of information from an image, otherwise known as computer vision. As this was a field that I had some experience in through university research placements, as well as an interest, I was keen to apply to the, for the internship. My project was the Autopathic Detection and Assessment of Damaged Traffic Signs. This involved extending a state-of-the-art object detection algorithm, known as Efficient Debt, to extract information characterizing sign damage. My project also involved extending a synthetic data pipeline, which would be used to generate the images required to train the model. This is important, this topic is important, as traffic sign auditing is a costly task when performed manually. By introducing automatic real-time detection utilizing the dashcam footage of public transport systems, we can hope to maintain our traffic signs more often and more cheaply. My goals for this project were creating a ev sequence evaluation heuristic. This is a method to choose the best object detection prediction out of all the predictions outputted by a model over a sequence of images rather than a single image. Performing evaluation experiments in efficient debt. Extending the data set generation pipeline to add customizable bending, light source detection, as well as other quality of life changes. And finally, integrating damage assessment to the efficient debt architecture. All of these goals were completed. In terms of the outcome, the extended efficient debt architecture unfortunately did not converge to a high accuracy for damage assessment. This is likely because the task was too difficult to generalize to due to the large range of damage modes and the continuous nature of the problem of damage severity. In conclusion, the Palsy internship was a great opportunity that I thoroughly enjoyed participating in. This opportunity helped me appreciate the complexity and architectural choices for a deep learning model and understand the concepts regarding building and training these models. Furthermore, I learned how to use the Slurm workload management system to allocate jobs and perform computation on these supercomputers. Although I wish I had more time to improve upon the architecture of the extended efficient debt model, this experience was incredibly educational and interesting.